Auda uh, Audacity. That's a whole different program. Um, Audible. Audible.com. Promo code. Just kidding. I'm not really sponsored. Um, and so I'm really enjoying those. Um, so I've been I've been listening to quite a bit of those. Now I'm on to like a MMORPG, uh, but from like first person like perspective of somebody that's uh, that's living it, the, living the thing. It's pretty cool. Uh, I forget the name of it, but it's, it's sweet. I like it. Um, so I've been enjoying that one. I'm almost done with book one, and then there's like six more after that. So I'm, I'm gonna listen to all those. It'll be amazing. Do, 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 do. Okay. Um, so we worked on uh, this a bunch. We're gonna continue doing. Uh, I think that that one first because we already have the template. And then I'm gonna do the sides, and then um, and then the other side and stuff. So we'll start with that. In fact, actually, we may be able to shortcut uh, having to go all the way up on the side if we just build it on this side. We'll have to keep. Okay, so keep in mind, uh, I've added more things onto the tower there, so there'll be one in from the sides, and then we also don't have any ground here right now. We'll have to add that in at some point. Uh, for now, we can just do cobblestone. So let's just do some cobblestone to get over there. So we have some basic building blocks to build onto. Okay. And then I guess we'll go on this side too. Um, but yeah, so I've been um, really enjoying that. Yesterday I had my first class, although I guess I streamed yesterday, so I probably talked about it already. Um, I'm working on the homework. Accounting is cool. Um, I've, uh, I'm, I'm, so now the, the homework for the first class, I mean, it's not really the first class because we already have one class, but the homework is uh, um, is uh, like reading the material and taking like a little quiz in, on the reading material for the topics that we talked about in the first class. It's a, it's a lot more, I don't know if I really, I mean, I guess probably, because I've already taken this um, accounting class before. Um, uh, I guess I want this. I've already taken basically this accounting class before, but it was like 11 years ago or whatever. So, or probably more than that. Uh, 13 years ago, maybe? Um, and so I'm retaking, essentially retaking the class um, so that I can be fresh on the topics. So, um, so it's, it's, the material is coming easy because I've already kind of already done it. Feather Falling Boots, yeah. Boop. have to be creative. In fact, I think I'll probably just do one of those. Hello, J. Cole, how are you? Okay, yeah, we can just put one down. There we go. That works out better. Uh, and I should have made more. No, I guess I have a little bit more. I am doing excellent. I have a little bit of a headache. I'm not sure why, actually, because it was actually cold when I woke up. Usually, it's if I'm warm when I'm sleeping, uh, it's when I get my headaches, but for some reason, I got one anyway. I don't know. Who knows? Um, but uh, overall, pretty good. Weather's good. Um, like I was saying, I'm enjoying my my accounting class. Um, enjoying the homework. They're like, I think I'm gonna be able to absorb all the content pretty well because they they're doing like multi multi pronged approach where there's gonna be the lecture, which is the main thing I learned from. Um, but then also they're having you read the book, take a quiz on the material. But it's also an online thing, which is something that I didn't really even have at all back when I was actually in college. Um, and so that will be interesting. So it's like the material is, um, so you can read it and then, and then there's like little like practice things so that it'll test to see like if you really absorbed the knowledge from the reading. And then if not, then it sort of sends you back to that section and like highlights the section that you screwed up on. Um, so it's, oh, it's interesting, interesting way of doing things. Um, oh, I have to think here to do that. Uh, and then there's going to be quizzes on that, and then there's actually the lecture on it, and then homework on the lecture. So there's like every single thing, <laughs> every different way that they could try to get you to learn it. Oh, and there's also then also online there's videos that relate to the um, to the reading, right? Yeah. So you you have the little practice stuff, but there's also little videos that will cover the same material again. So lots of different ways to do it. So I think it'll, it'll work out pretty well. And I like accounting, so it should should be pretty easy. 
I like the balancing the equation. Anyway. Um, my grass is growing. That's what else is new. I've been, <laughs> I've been, in fact, right now I'm watering, watering some grass. I have, I have a sprinkler going. Exciting stuff. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm just part-time, like super part-time. Um, my, uh, my wife works at the university, and so I have uh, free tuition because of that. Or at least a like, small amount of free tuition, but enough where if I'm only taking one or two classes, then it works out. Uh, and, and I have my own business, and so I figured, uh, like I'm, I have a programming degree already, but I wanted to uh, you know grow my business correctly. And so I've decided to, um, to take some accounting or business business classes to um to sort of make up make make uh properly run my business i guess so uh, let's grab some cobblestone we're running low and then we'll just leave oh here we can do this there we go all right and i have, we'll run out of inventory space in a second i don't need signs okay um yes i work from home yeah, and, and luckily my, my work is cool enough where I could say, like, all right, I'm planning on taking some classes to do business stuff, which is going to help you in the long run anyway, because then I can program with more knowledge um, of, like, how accounting stuff works or how business things work or whatever. Um, and so then I'm able to, you know, adjust my schedule for my hours pretty well. Uh, and next semester, some of my classes or one of my classes will be online. The other one's actually in class. Um, and so that will also will be a little easier because working from home, um, I'll be able to um, have more freedom where I don't have to worry about actually getting to class at the right time. All right, we're going to need some, some of these, not a whole lot right now. Um, and we're going to need more stairs. Let's get our bar set up in the right way for success. We're going to need some, uh, some of these. And we already have some of the stairs. What am I forgetting? Uh, that might be good. That might be good for what we need. Uh, and the reason why we need these is because I'm going to replace this floor. Uh, so we don't... Yeah, we already have... Let's grab this. Oh, we'll, we'll leave it there because we'll probably... You know, I guess... Okay. We're going to need this to get rid of the floor. We're going to duplicate the pattern that we have over there. Oop. Um, just because that'll be an easy choice to start with. And now we want to get this on the bar. So I told stories is that, yeah, uh, it is a adventure map. Is that how I would define it? It is a um, kind of um, in, the, in the sense that we're on an adventure, but not in the sense that we're in adventure mode. So um, yes, it's an adventure map, but b because um, Minecraft has adventure mode. I would be hesitant to to call it an adventure map, although although we're going on an adventure. But so it's a it's a custom map that someone's created where you're generally in survival. Uh, maybe almost always in survival, um, and you are um, trying to get the wolves. So you are uh, trying to um, you know each each level has its own little stuff and. Yeah, it's it's yeah, CTM. Yeah, it is it is a lot of fun. I, I wish that the downside to uh, doing all this different stuff I'm doing, like working on my business and taking classes and stuff, is that it kind of takes away from my gaming time. It's like oh my gaming time, but luckily I have enough with doing my streaming during the day, and then whenever I have time, actually editing and then putting it on YouTube, um, that helps quite a bit with being able to sort of keep up with um, uh, with gaming still. Uh, and at least getting like some, you know, hanging out with you guys some, and getting, um, getting some of the, uh, um, like my gaming time in, because like I, I've had to sort of drop some other stuff. But like, also, what's also nice is that I'm doing audiobooks, so I'm able to get a lot of different cool like adventures through the audiobooks um, that I, you know, w wouldn't otherwise have. So it's kind of cool. It is tough trying. Um, tough. Uh, oh, you thought about trying? Uh, yeah, yeah. It's definitely the CTM maps, uh, Untold Stories, like three and four, and I think there's a five. Um, they're a lot of fun. Ragecraft series, a lot of fun. Um, the they're 
They're possibly tag consuming, depending on the map. Although the one we're doing right now in Told Stories 4 is kind of an easier of them. So if you're trying to get into it, that might be a good one to start on so you can get a feel for some of the uh, some of the stuff. Gaming time comes from being successful with everything else. Yeah, that's true. Right, right, right. Um, yeah, that's true. Very true. Let me uh, get these in place. I'm going to make a day in a second, just so we don't have bad guys spawning on our heads. Do, 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 do. Um, here we go. Okay. And then we actually, in this corner, we want to uh, finish off the corner piece. Oop. No, try again. But yeah, like, and, and each of the different uh, map creators that do the um, these different CTM maps, they all have their sort of same sort of style. I mean, there's through a lot of them, there's sort of similarities that run through them, but um, there's a lot of sort of uniqueness um, to a number of them. So it's it's a lot of fun. Um, there and here yeah so I'm sure it goes like this and then I'm pretty sure it's only like that and then on the inside do we have just the blow oh yeah yeah okay we go like that and that's gonna be a circle there right 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 and then here we have stairs that go there and there it's on top I've already built two of these yesterday so kind of have a feel for the way it's set up and then over here we have that and that that stays open okay so now we just need to add in the stairs I think it's good and we'll double check the light levels but I think we're we should be good so let's try to build this See if we can in one go. No, we can't. Okay. <laughs> There's some technique for getting it to actually behave. There we go. That's what I want. Behave the way you want. Oh no. So maybe if I point into the bottom corner of them, it'll work the first time. Ooh. Yeah, that might have worked. Uh, we're going to be one short, but I have one over there, so that works out. Okay, and this guy goes right here. Okay, double check the light levels. Uh, eight. Yeah, should we just go down to eight? Okay, good. Um, so inventory space, uh, we're a little bit low. Uh, actually, we know we're we're fine. We can get rid of these. Then we're gonna do the top part. So up here, um, we have uh, these things that are coming out through here. So these are solid blocks there and there. So solid blocks there and there. And then I think over here as well. Actually, in the outside, it, it might not. Because here we don't have the supporting. Like on, on the outside of the building, we don't have these supporting beams. So I think these are actually stairs, maybe. Um, all right, I'm gonna double check. But either way, we want to build up these uh, these fence posts anyway, so we'll get to that. Let's double check. It was only yesterday that I built this, but I forget. Okay, um, so actually, one more up. Or no, we don't need to go this here. So we have. Uh, so stairs across the whole thing. Okay, got it. Oh, no, and there's actually no... Oh, there's a way in. All right. Okay, I thought there was no way in up here. Oh, good. How can we... Okay. So on the outside, we just have stairs. Which 
we don't have any because we used them a lot. Right. So let's make some stairs. Do, 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 do. Okay. Um, so we have stairs coming across all of here. Not there because there's going to be a water spout thing. And then here, same thing. And do we fill in the corners? Yes. So they come like this. Corner. Corner. And corner. Okay. And then we have this. Uh, oh no, it's totally okay, dude. Um, if if you uh, you know if you're if you're able to and you know whatever, then that's cool. Um, if you feel like you'd like to, um, but I totally understand um, not being able to. It's cool. All right. Um, so we'll go like this. Oh, awesome. Thank you. Yeah, I, I do too. I do too. Yeah. Oh, well, that's definitely a good reason not to do it. Definitely a good reason. I've been actually trying to pare back because a lot like the funding that I have, uh, like I'm, I'm trying to make it so that like Basket MC company, it's not really its own company, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to get that to be, you know, kind of self-sustaining. So I had to pare back some of mine as well. I was patrons, patron and stuff to a lot of a lot of different things. I had to pull some of it back. I'm trying to remember uh, what the sequence is for this, because uh, it's going to be stair going either one of these two directions. Let's double check, just so we have it consistent. I think so. These two are mirrored to each other, and so I'm going to make this one be. Um, to follow the same sort of thing. So let's let's look at where we are. So it's back there. So then this one is so the one that's closest that we're gonna have pointing to the outside. Okay, we'll do that. So this one's gonna be pointing to the outside of the building, and then we'll use that as the template. And then I will read chat in a second. I want to make sure I don't forget what I'm doing. Okay, so we'll come up here. So this one is going to be Facing towards the outside. Okay. Well, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, this is uh, it's coming along together really well. Um, I, the most recent I, I sort of have like general stuff, and then I was trying. I was like, all right, I'll come back to the battlements later. So then the last like week or two has just been adding in the battlements, which has you know resulted in a lot of different textures and things added in, um, which made made everything look a lot lot better than it did uh, with the first the first sort of uh, section of it. Um, I think that um, I have, I'd have to double check, but I believe that it's it, it's tied into just the patron patron list. So I don't I don't believe so. Yeah, I think it's yeah. I'd have to double check, but I believe that's the answer. Um, okay, so I think that on top of this we have this as well, and then behind them we have this. Pretty sure, and then um, let's see. So it's four. Yeah, well, we should have enough uh, of these stairs. Yeah, and that's mainly just to keep it fair for everybody. I, I, you know, in a in a in a, I guess in a perfect world, I could be, I could just make up my own rules, but <laughs> I, I don't want to break my own rules. I guess, I guess I. Because I made the rules, but I don't want to break my own rules and then make people feel like it's unfair or something. I don't know. Anyway, I think you understand. So we'll do torches on these guys. Okay, so this thing is all good. Uh, how's our inventory? So we are a little bit low. Oh, no, we can combine some stuff. There we go. Okay. Is this all good to go? We have the torches. Oh, I know what I have to do. I have to um, replace these windows. Oh, and also build up the fences on the outside. I forgot about. So then this is the new windows. 
for this these spots. Oops. That one thought I was too close to it. This, I think, yeah, there's no window here. And this is the door to get out. We do want to replace um, this, like that. And then we're going to add in those pillars. So we're going to need a few more. And we're going to need some blocks to pillar up with. Okay. And then they're going to be up on either side of that. A second just so we don't have any bad guys but we're nearly done with this part and then we'll, we can do that and then that side I guess that side we'll have to decide on a couple things uh, in terms of the the supporting beams but we'll look at how long that is and then try to figure out the the correct way to do that side I saw a penny arcade they changed um, from doing like a membership on their regular website to doing Patreon. So I also decided that I was going to. I've, I've been a member on their, um, on their on their site for a bit. I decided that I was going to forgo that for now, since I have. I don't really know when the next time I'll be at a uh, at a PAX will be. We'll see. Okay, so I think that's good. So now that's the template for. Um, for here. This one is a lot less space, but let's um, potentially mirror it. So then this line here is where um, the... Oh, let's get some blocks in the bar. So potentially where this would be, and then there'd be a slab on top of that. And then stairs on either side. And then here's where the drain would be. I think we'll keep that in there. Um, so let's put in the drain. And then what, what else goes here? I don't know. Something. I feel like something goes there, but okay. So we have this and this. And then this on that side. I forget back to work. All right. Well, thank you for stopping by, John. Appreciate it. Oh, I stairs is what it's supposed to go there. All right. There we go. But I need to make more stairs. Okay. All right. So it's gonna go like this. Um, here there will be. Uh, I'll have to see how this looks on the outside. I may want to wrap that around a little bit more than I have it. but So then this would be a stair there, and then we'll go ahead and put that there and this on top. So we'll, we'll want to see... Oh, and, um, and I guess here we'll do a block, and then like that. So battlements on this side, we'll see how that looks there. I don't know if we want to attach that or not. Um... For now, let's suppose we do want to attach it. So right now there is not, so this block here. So if you add stairs here, and a block here, and then try to get this one to curve in, if you can. That might help with, yeah. Okay, so now let's see what that looks like. Let's do some, uh, some trick shots. Okay, good. <laughs> All right, so we have to decide how we like that. I guess we need to go further out, which is going to make it make us be make it a bit harder to uh, get back. But okay, so because there's not a lot of space right there, so what we're looking at is this thing here. So keep in mind, this is all going to change out here. There's going to be a tower there, a tower there, um, but we're mainly looking at how does that look.
So we might actually not want to have it. Well, it's tough because because that tower is there. It kind of makes things a little weird. Um. Very weird looking thing. Uh, I mean, part of me, I'll, I'll. Thank you for the follow. Person who has a name. Do, 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 do. So we have to decide. So I could, I mean, I could extend that out. Um, oh, right, hold on, <laughs> I'm used to JJ Bonzig doing my, uh, doing my stuff, hold on, uh, um, <laughs> uh, do, 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 Now I screwed everything up. Okay. I think everything is fine now. <laughs> I banned my own bot. Okay. All right. Um, so really what I want to do. <laughs> oh. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, nobody's perfect. Look at this. Huh. Okay, whatever. I don't care. I give up. Alright. Um, so. Focusing. <laughs> they need to change somehow. So I could, I could make it not stick out from the wall. And that probably make it better. Uh, there's not a lot of space there. So then another option would be is if I had the tower actually come out from the wall one more, and so I, just a thicker wall to see how that looks. I have to fix, I have to probably change the uh, the roof there. Um, but, so the other option is from here, at this point I can make this tower, that wall be flat. So make it so it's not actually gonna be in that adjusted shape. And I think that will be okay on each floor. Um, where the stairs are and stuff, I don't think that'll cause too many problems. Probably. All right, so let's try to get into the tower. <laughs> <laughs> where would this put me? Okay, I'm short. It's a shame. Okay, so shortcut. Through the wall. Um, I'll leave it open for now. Um, so then to get back up there, um, yeah, I have no plans of, okay, so I'll have to just let's go up the stairs. Whee! And then this should be the main floor. There we go. Oh, can't get through. So, what we could do is I could bring this wall out. Let's try to bring out two more. So we're gonna have to. We're, I'm gonna build a, a thing to actually transition the floor um, to make sense. But for now, what we'll do is get rid of this. And so let's pop into here just so we can put it in the right spot. So starting from here, I'm going to move this over that direction, move this section out by two. So let's remove this. Um, we could probably actually build a lot of this from up here instead of having to build up a huge pillar. So what we want is this, this floor to come out to here. So that tells me that I'm going to need... 
some stuff over there. So let's get a little floor to get over here. So then this will be a stair and then another stair here. So we might slope it out like that in order to move the wall out. Okay, so we can get rid of these. And then we'll just fill it in for now. And then put these in here. And then bring this out some more, like that. Uh, we can add in cracked stone, although I guess we've already come back through and added cracked stone, so I'll have to, I'll, I'll, I'll put it in later. I don't want to do it right now. Um, so then these are the windows. We have these here, so we'll actually change these back out for to be stairs. And then we'll put in this. So this whole thing is going to be replaced. So let's, uh, this wall is going to be finished all the way. Going all the way up. We'll have to fix the roof. Uh, I mean, it'll make it a little easier for the roof, but... Okay. Hello, uh, Jolo... Uh, Swaya? Welcome. Uh, okay, so we're going to fix the roof, but for now we'll leave it like that. Um, so the roof will probably be easier, although I guess we're still going to have... Unless I do the same thing on this side. I could I could increase this on that side. That'll be harder to really set up, um, but... Thank you for the follow, Quad Becky. Welcome. Okay, so then this wall is going to be replaced. So this side here, we can just build up. Uh, the windows will have to come back through and adjust. Um, let's also make it day before the bad guys spawn. Oh my goodness, that is a lot of a lot of random characters. So let's get in here and make it day, real quick. Hello, Quad Becky. Welcome. All right. So now we want to move. Uh, this is not my fortune. Or sorry, I want a silk touch pick just to save these guys. This is where the window goes. Um, we get rid of this, and uh, we can get rid of that whole line there. So we're, we're just moving this whole wall out a little bit. So we can kind of build it up as we go. And then this is actually going to be the, uh, you don't like this build or something. You don't like something. What don't you like? What's wrong? Let's eat. I'm going to need to get more. There we go. Cool. I do have more. So this is going to be the floor here. I might change this out to be, um, that material but for now we'll put in the floor like that uh, this wall can go and actually now that I guess the whole window could change now that the wall is flat there uh, interesting okay well, well we'll think about that I move up hmm because now I'm, I'm not as restricted to the space that I was before. So I can put the window in however I want. So if we wanted to add in those textured things um, to this column, we could. Uh, I do not. I do not right now. I'm just sort of actually, I, there's not too much more in my stream. Um, about 20 minutes or so. But, um, but I'm not really... I usually only co-stream with... Uh, with Scotty, when I want to actually co-stream, like a sort of plan, plan him ahead a bit. Uh, okay, a little blocks. Let's grab some more. Looks like this is the bedroom, so I'll have to adjust some of this as well. And then the roof here this is kind of screwed up. Expanding this wall out so that it looks nicer with the battlements. <laughs> and really, I don't, I don't know exactly. Well, I mean, I understand my reasoning originally for making this uh, smaller than I did, but um, I, I don't like it anymore. Okay, so I think we're going to expand this floor out with birch. 
instead of the stone. And then we can decide how we want to do the windows. But we could base it on... Um, uh, I'm putting the wrong spot. Um, so partly what I have going on here is um, is just because of the sort of there's a secret door thing coming up there. So I might have to adjust some of that. But for now we can just put in this floor like this. Like that. Um, and then how do we want to do... How do I want to do the window? If I wanted to do the same the same pattern for um, the supporting beams that I have in the other towers, that would be lined up there. So I might adjust where this window is, uh, and maybe this one as well. But we have to decide this wall here. I could move some of it out, um, but I guess for now what we can do is fill this in. Uh, we can assume that there's probably going to be some sort of window change there. Um, let's fill in the rest of the wall, whatever's maybe missing. And we can get a look for it from the outside and then decide where it makes sense to have the windows. So this window's still here, but we might move it. Uh, wh what I want to see is this supporting change that I have there, I want to see how that looks uh, from far away. So let's get a feel for that. So it's not bad. Um, I mean, again, so the roof will change. Um, I think that it might make more sense for it to go kind of diagonally out. Uh, thank you for the follow, uh, Sharky Tax. I think I still have banned my bot. <laughs> is my bot is my bot still here? Unban. Basketball. I'm sorry, basketball. I'm sorry, I banned you, basketball. Come back. Come back. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, E S R Reaper. Okay. Well, I don't know. My bot. My bot's gone. I accidentally bought, uh, banned it earlier. <laughs> So what I'm trying to decide is, I might make this tower come out more. We can let's try and make this diagonal, or make this like uh, go triangularly diagonally. The problem is though, it's only going to be two out and like four over. So uh, we might have to be creative a little bit with that. We'll see. That wasn't high enough. Do 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 do. So let's get. Uh, up there, although it might just be easier from out here. So we can kind of sculpt a little easier. Um, right. One more. Okay, one more. Alright, so now we have these blocks. So what I'm going to try and do is make it be kind of more diagonal with the chain. Um, so then I guess I'll remove these. Luckily I got a lot of them back. Let's take this. So, um, let's make it diagonally out from here first. What's the best way to do this? Um, Let's give it a little, a little bit of room to walk around. So if we do this, and then we angle this in. Thank you for the host, E S P Reaper. Let's do that, and then if we put this here, will that connect? Okay, so that now we've angled that a little bit, so that I think helps. What I don't know is, can we make this guy? Oh, we can. Okay, so maybe that will help. 
make it look a little better with the transition between there and there. So let's try that. Uh, what is connected here? So let's cut this all the way down. Okay, there we go. Ooh, how long have I been working on this castle? Uh, quite a while. Um, I started working on it some, and then I had stopped to work on some other projects. So it's hard to say exactly, but quite a bit of time. Um, if you go on my YouTube channel, my bot, I think my bot is still angry at me because I banned it <laughs> earlier. Um, I meant to ban the person that, that was... Uh, anyone. Oh, anyway, anyway, so yeah, that doesn't work. Um, if you go to baskmc.com, Uh, there's a link, yeah, <laughs> right, uh, if, there's a link on there, um, for my YouTube channel, uh, so on there I have a playlist, all of that playlist contains, I also have this huge iron farm craziness base on the server, um, and so that base is on the same playlist, so that play, that whole playlist playtime isn't really going to match exactly, but, okay, so I think that works out pretty well, uh, I do need to, obviously, I need to fix these windows, uh, but that looks good for the transition between um, being a smaller tower to a larger tower. This is the royal royal estate tower. Um, so I need to fix the roof. Um, and then I need to decide how the windows are going to work on this thing. Um, and I might consider... Here I have some extra textures. Because I have the fences uh, as sort of like supporting pillars there. So I might do the same thing here and then change the way these windows work. Um, I forget... Uh, why exactly these are only three wide there? I mean, there's a staircase in there. Oh, and I guess I have a secret, I have a secret hallway thing there, so that could be uh, part of it as well. Hmm. Um, so I guess let's let's see what our options are. I could make those windows just smaller in general, maybe. But yeah, we have I have a secret tunnel that goes through here to get up there. Um, so I think that's why these aren't centered. Let's make a day. No zombies or creepers. Uh, creepers are actually what I'm mostly afraid of because they <laughs> keep on destroying everything. Not that I, like, I survive it, but then like I have to rebuild big chunks of stuff. Alright, I think we can actually make a shortcut here. Yeah, yeah. So this is going to be an easier shortcut to get uh, up into the tower then going all the way up okay so I might I need to change this a little bit if I want to put in actually I guess that could still work here so the fence would actually just be here so that's doable okay and then it would be here um, that might be awkward once it gets up to this section for it to be there but that's doable at least from this side from here that would be here and then here and that would go up top. And then we could also then decide if we want to make this square off to be, um, to increase out. Because then that'll transition better between once I build these battlements in. So I think we'll do that. Um, yeah, let's do that. Let's build a pillar up to um, kind of square off. Is it a square? I don't really know if it's going to be a square. But it's going to be a rectangle at the very least. Not... Not with this indentation here. I feel like that... We'll look at it from far away. But I think that it's going to look better uh, without that extra indentation. Are we... Okay. We're already, we're already here. Let's actually go down a little bit. So what we want to do is... Um, we want to line up the floor. I guess we need to find out where the floor is. Uh, well, it's more important to actually line it up with the other side. Um, so that would be lining it up with the floor. So, are there plans for a throne room? Yeah, there is a throne room um, down in the very bottom. Uh, I don't have the design for the throne yet. I have the throne room and a secret door in the back. Um, and, and then I don't have anything below the, the room of the throne room. So I was also thinking about maybe a secret door in the throne that gets you into a secret room below the throne room. Uh, but I also, yeah, so one thing I have in here, just to give an idea of what's how it's set up so i have uh secret tunnels going all over the place so you saw there was that one ladder um but then if we come over here and we go down 
Um, there's this place here, and for now I don't actually have secret doors built in. These eventually will be paintings or some sort of thing. But this is a secret tunnel that gets you into this main secret area. So this is a whole secret room. Uh, this gets you into the royal suite. So if you come up... Oh, I can't get up. So through here, it's a secret tunnel that goes into um, this room here. And then a ladder goes up. You can work your way over here. Uh, here's a secret door into that room, maybe. A secret through there, a secret through there. And then this room here... Um, is actually so there it's it's closed otherwise but then this lets you get into um, the royal bedroom so this is the royal bedroom and then by opening up that chest the secret door hides itself so anyway so I'm doing a bunch of different stuff like that where um, where I have secret doors and a lot of them aren't gonna be redstone based they're just gonna be like a painting in the wall that you can that you can walk through so a certain painting the like the little guys like the woodcutter guy um, is the one that we're, I'm basing it on. So that allows you to get through here, and then you can just close it up on your way down. Um, so by extending this wall out, I you know I either am going to move some of the secret door stuff, or I just may not have windows exactly on the same side over there. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, but again, secret doors all over the place. I'll give a little tour. We'll head over to the secret or to this. So here's another room here. This is all. This is a secret room, sort of inside the walls. Um, and then this heads uh, down into the very full basement. But we want to get to. Um, we want to get over by the throne room. So actually, so what you have to do in this case is you get up to the main floor, right here, and then you could head over to here, and then go down this ladder. So then this goes through some more spots, secret secret areas. Uh, apparently I broke a ladder at one point, so it's going to be hard to get back up. <laughs> and I broke another one, I guess, there. So I'll have to fix that. Uh, oh, I guess I'll have to... Oh, no, here. Is here where I want to go? Maybe. So this is the hallway that gets me into here. Secret door going that direction, and this is the throne room. So this is the throne room here. Some sort of stained glass window at some point. Uh, some, uh, some sort of throne that actually looks like a throne. Seating on the side. Um, and this is the front door here. And this goes out to um, the, the... So this is the keep. This is the castle here. And then if we run out the front door... Um, design of a tall style door. So, okay, cool. Oh, you, you dig it. Okay, cool, yeah. Like, yeah, I was trying to figure out... the Minecraft's hard with blocks. <laughs> <laughs> so I was trying to figure out a way so like these here are uh, the, the uh, portcullis that come down, trap you in here and then the murder things to drop like you know bad stuff on you um, and so yeah this is what I wanted to have door like you know the spruce doors on top of each other but you can't you can't have spruce doors on top of spruce doors they, they have to be on a solid surface so that's what I had to go with um, there's the barracks gatehouse and then if you come out here this is, uh, and again, so these things are actually what's going to, supposed to be below that. I just haven't put those up there. Uh, the portcullis up there, and uh, drawbridge. And this is the start of the town. So we have the inn, or uh, sorry, the tavern, the inn there, uh, library. Eventually that nether portal will be somewhere else because it's it doesn't really fit thematically right there. Um, but yeah, this is the outside of the, uh, of the place, of the front. So we're, right now we're sort of working on putting in um, the battlements going along the outside, but then adding in textures, replacing windows, making things look a little cleaner. Uh, we have a lot of the the main structure of the place in place already, uh, minus the basement. We haven't done the basement at all for the keep. Um, but yeah, that is the quick tour. Um, oh, and I guess, so the so these things are, they're not functional, obviously, but they're, so they're inside of here. This is where you can drop the the, you know, whatever on the bad guys uh, that are trying to get in and then if we go up a floor into here this is the big cranks that you can use to bring up the the portcullis right now it's already up but I guess you could lower it from here and then this is a big dining room once there's more furniture in here so I have to do furniture as well some sort of big window there and then we have sorry headphone users um, uh, more dining up here, so more tables. 
this floor is uh, bedrooms. So I need to, you know, there's smaller bedrooms. Next floor is uh, larger bedrooms. So the, uh, you know, fancier guests or whatever are in here, plus secret doors that go throughout the wall. There's all kinds of secret doors everywhere. That's how that's how I, that's what I like is secret doors. So here's a secret door it goes through there. Uh, this is just a regular closet. That's pretty dark. Um, but yeah, so that's that's the uh, that's the 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 dime tour or whatever, whatever they say, <laughs> whatever those sayings are. Um, okay, so where was I? Uh, we want to add, we want to make, extend this out, and we want to make sure it's on the proper floor. So let's. Look to see where the floors are. So if we break into here, is this the right? Okay, so this is actually lined up. So the top of this is the floor that we want to extend out. So with that being said, um, so this is the floor here. So we're going to extend out the floor. It's going to go like that. So we need to adjust um, this stuff to fit that. So we're going to go like that, and then just build in the stairs from there. So that one, it'll connect okay. And then here, if we go there, nope. If we go there, no. We have to be positioned differently. If I go here, good. Like it. Is that right? That's not quite right. If I go here, there. So now we have stairs there and there. Okay, so then that is where we can build the top of that coming up. Uh, and so I don't need to be down here anymore. Let's get rid of this. I have, I have a, a lots of big plans. So there's this is a I mean, there's a lot to still do. Um, there's going to be a huge harbor there. Um, this road, this is a whole like island structure. So there's going to be that town there. There's going to be some more town over that way. And the road continues on and goes all over the place. So I have a lot of big plans. So I'll be working on this one for many years. <laughs> Uh, the plan is once 1.13 comes out, we'll just update the server. We're not going to do a reset, um, so that we can keep everything, keep the different builds working on. Uh, okay, so do I have enough things? Is this the community style or uh, this particular build is a solo project? I mean, there's a couple things like I have some shops uh, out there that I'm planning on most likely saying like, well, this shop is intended to be a flower shop. So, you know, JJ Bonzig, feel free to make this be a flower shop. And then she can add in furniture and, and you know, storage and stuff like that for whatever the whatever the place happens to do. Um, but otherwise, it's generally speaking, it's a, just a solar project. Um, so far, it's been a solar project. Uh, and a lot of some of the supplies um, I've gotten from other people uh, that are on the server. But otherwise, the actual building itself has, has all been me, I think. I apologize if that's not actually the case, but I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure that I, nobody else has built anything else. Uh, on the iron farm project, I, I did have some digging and some other stuff, uh, placing down items and stuff uh, from some other people that were that are on the server. Uh, but this particular part of it, I haven't really had uh, any help on. So I have to decide. Because this one, there's secret door space that works throughout here. So I don't know exactly how it's going to work for the windows on the on this particular wall. So I mean, at the very least, I could really just not use this space. I didn't want to jump down here. <laughs> um, or I could make it be more secret space. I could move the secret wall, things like that, different options. Um, do I have some stone, any of these? Let's cobble some. My dog and my bark in a second. Um, there we go. So for now, I'll just fill it in. And then I might come through and adjust the inside to work with it. So here is where it will carry over. Um, so eventually there'll be a window here. For now, I'll just block it off. Just 
Probably just not a window there. I wonder why. Um, and then this will be, I'll fix the roof. And actually, let's also throw down a torch here. So I'll fix the roof at some point. So the roof will now be able to just be a regular rectangle. Um, or possibly, so here I have, um, it's interesting, the snow is formed on top of the glass. I didn't consider that. Anyway, um, with this design here, it's a like a slower roof. Um, and then it has a skylight on top that apparently will be covered up by snow. Um, so that's something I could add in instead. I don't know. We'll see. Snow, huh? <laughs> hmm. I built the whole thing so it wasn't spawnable. Uh, but I didn't really consider that if it actually does, if I let it snow, that there'd be snow on top of it. And just blocking the light. Actually, does that block light? I wonder. Well, let's, let's, uh, let's experiment with our remaining time in the stream. So that that's there. Uh, but let's go ahead and put um, some other blocks blocking the rest of it. So we have potentially sunlight that would go through there. So let's pop down here and look to see. So from the sky, um, it's actually up to 14. As we go away from the window, it goes up. To, so, okay. So that looks like snow does allow light through. So as a test, we'll remove that, put that on, and just d double check. So now if we come over here. Yeah, okay, so for then from sky. Okay, so even if there is snow on top, that still does light through. Okay. There we go. Science. Um, but that will be, that'll be it for today's stream. So we're, uh, we've now changed the royal tower part. So I'll have to adjust some of the insides of there and decide exactly where um, some of the placement of things will be. Let's pop over there just so we can look at our planning for our, the next stream. Which is a pass by tomorrow. Tomorrow would be careful space program usually, but um, I'm still waiting on the some of their mods to be updated. So, um, so we've we've expanded this out. So I need to decide what the style is of this building. Um, potentially adding in these these things to add in the cool textures, but then that sort of accents that this thing is sort of a weird off center thing. So I might want to adjust, maybe make those just be two wide um, instead of three wide, uh, because then it would be centered. Uh, so that might be an easy solution, um, is just make these windows be a little bit smaller. And then once it gets up to this top part, then you know change the way things work a little bit. Yeah, that'll be the plan, I think. That's uh, that's most likely tomorrow's stream. I um, hope everybody has enjoyed watching. Thank you, everybody, for stopping by. Thank you.